We've now had some leaks in the form of 360 renders for the upcoming Huawei P30. The P30 is most likely going to be launched soon and surprisingly we haven't had much information so far. From the 360 renders though, we can see they've opted for a full screen display with a water drop style notch. The display is rumoured to be an OLED panel measuring its 6 inches with a full HD plus resolution of 1080 by 2340. The selfie camera inside the water drop notch is also reported to be 24 megapixels. We can see from the leaked designs that the button layout is pretty standard and what we would expect from the phone. The phone will of course be using USB Type-C and one thing you will notice is the return of the 3.5mm headphone jack. If these leaks are to be correct then that's great news for music lovers. The dimensions of this phone is reportedly 149 by 71 by 7.5 millimeters. The absence of any kind of fingerprint sensor on the body leads to the assumption that this will of course have its fingerprint scanner built into the display. Some rumors are suggesting the sensor may be built into the power button, but personally I think that is very unlikely. Given that the P20 Pro also had facial recognition, it would be safe to assume that this is coming to the P30. While its predecessor, the P20, had a dual camera setup on the rear, the P30 is upgrading to a triple camera layout stacked vertically. We're expecting a 40 megapixel main sensor, along with a 5 megapixel telephoto lens and a 20 megapixel wide angle sensor. There were reports of 5 times optical zoom, and given that the P20 Pro was the first phone to feature this without the need for retractable lenses, this seems quite likely. And of course, given that this is Huawei, we can expect some useful AI functions to work with the camera application. When it comes to chipsets, Huawei always uses their own in-house chips, so we can be pretty certain that this device is going to be using the latest Kirin 980 system on chip. It's most likely going to come with two different storage options, 128 or 256 gigabyte, and will be available with 6 or 8 gigabytes of RAM. In terms of battery, there's been no leaked info yet, but I would expect to see something around 4000 milliamp hours, and of course it will support fast charging. And the phone will come with Android 9 Pie out of the box in the form of Huawei's EMUI 9. In terms of pricing, there haven't been any leaks yet, but it shouldn't be long until the phone's officially launched. The P20 was launched at €650, Euros, which is $850, so it'll be interesting to see if Huawei can stick to roughly the same price again. The launch of the P20 was the 27th of March, so we'd expect the P30 to be around the same date, although given that Huawei have confirmed attendance at Mobile World Congress in Barcelona next month, it could be that the phone is launched a bit earlier. All in all though, it's looking to be a great device. Huawei are continuing to grow in the mobile industry as they create some great devices at some very reasonable prices. Last year, they've been very successful globally and I would imagine continued success for them in 2019. As always though, I'd like to know your thoughts down in the comments below. What do you think of these P30 leaks and will you be considering it for your next device? But thank you for watching the video and please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel.